tallest man in Africa. The tallest man in the world, according to the Guinness World Book of Records, is 8.2 feet tall Sultan Kusin from Turkey. In Africa, there are people who are equally very tall, like one time tallest man in the world, Radhwane Chabib from Tunisia. In this video, we bring you a few of the tallest Africans spotted online. First, it's from Botswana. Standing at a height of 7.2 feet or 2.2 meters tall, Yurukuvia Kandu is believed to be the tallest man in Botswana. The young man who is in his 20s hails from Kareng village in the Ingamiland district. He is the ninth sibling out of 11 from his mother's side. Yurukuvia is described as humble and with so much ambition of becoming a professional basketball player. At 7.2 feet or 2.2 meters tall, Ako Longwang is the tallest man in Uganda. Longwang lives in a tiny hut in Lamiru village. Longwang, who is in his 20s, says he has to twist himself in a tiny round hut and cover himself with two bed sheets that were sewed together. According to him, he appreciates his height sometimes but also hates it because children tease him and he has not been able to find love as girls avoid him. Lokwang also has a hard time finding fitting clothes and he cannot afford to have his clothes and shoes tailor made. He is the first born in a family of three and his parents are dead. Next is from Ethiopia. Standing at 2.2 meters or 7.2 feet tall, Ayete Sage Shanko from Tigray is Ethiopia's tallest man. Next is from Tanzania. At 7.4 feet or 2.20 meters tall, Baraka Elias is said to be the tallest man in Tanzania. Elias hit the international headlines after he told the BBC that because he is too tall, a hospital in his country says it's unable to treat his hip injury which happened after a fall. According to him, doctors at the hospital at Dar es Salaam told him that his height meant he would not fit properly in a hospital bed and also adding that their x-ray equipment was unsuitable for a man of his height. Next is Ola Dimeji from Nigeria. Standing at 7.4 feet tall, Afis Agoro Ola Dimeji is believed to be Nigeria's tallest man. He started growing abnormally at the age of 19 after falling ill several times. He was born in Lagos on the 13th of December 1975. He is the youngest of three children and he studied town and regional planning at the Lagos State Polytechnic for his HND. He also has a degree in computer science from the University of Lagos. In an interview, he said, Before my father died, he built a house that will be convenient for me to move in and out and that has helped me greatly as I bear the pain and challenges of rheumatism. Ola Dimeji, who has since been an actor and model, said his condition requires him to work out regularly to ease the load on his legs. Despite some of the setbacks he faces, he said he does not regret his condition as the positives are far greater than the negatives. Coming up next is Taco from Senegal. Senegal's tallest man appears to be the American NBA player, Taco Fall, who is also said to be NBA's tallest player. He is 7.6 feet tall and he is in his 20s. Taco left Senegal for the United States when he was 16 years old. He is also a player for the Senegalese national team. Next is Dembele from Ivory Coast. Abdramani Dembele is the tallest man in Ivory Coast and he is 7.7 .7 feet or 2.35 meters tall. He now lives in France. Abdramani Dembele, who speaks French and English, is an actor and a model. Next is Alex from Namibia. Alex Gomachab, who was born with Mafan syndrome, is believed to be the tallest man in Namibia. The 7.8 feet or 2.4 meters tall man believes that his condition may be more of a blessing than a curse. Born the last of 12 children, Alex wants to be a neuropsychologist after studying marketing at the Namibian University of Science and Technology. 
According to him, being tall has made kids and even adults to bully him. Alex says the open heart surgery he had in 2015 is one of his most inspiring life experiences. Apart from that, he has undergone multiple surgeries mostly to improve his vision and other complications. But he uses these to inspire and encourage himself as well as thank God for how far he has brought him. Next is Hussein from Somalia. Somalia's tallest man is Hussein Bissad who stands at around 7.8 feet tall. Interestingly, he is pushing to be recognized as the world tallest man. The current holder is 8.2 feet tall Sultan Hussein from Turkey. Bissad, who was born in 1975, says he is due for the title. Mr. Bissad now lives in England after fleeing civil war in his home country. Bissad, who says he is still getting taller every year, sleeps in a 9 feet bed. Doctors have, however, expressed concerns about Mr. Bissad's health, especially if he is still growing. Next is Ritesh from Kenya. The person considered as the tallest man in Kenya is Ritesh, a businessman who measures 7.9 feet tall. One problem Ritesh has is getting his shoe size. But during normal days, you could see him in open shoes that will allow his feet even touch the bare ground. Jackson Kipkirui Koske, who lives in Bomet, was at one time considered the tallest man in Kenya with a height of 7.3 feet. At 7.9 feet, Radhwan Chabib is the tallest man in Tunisia. Born on the 27th of October 1968, Chabib was recognized by the Guinness Book of World Records as the tallest living man until 15th of January 2005 when Baoxi Shan was measured at Shifeng City Hospital in Mongolia, China and was recorded as being 2 mm taller. Next is Abdu from Ghana. Abdu Sonet Suleiman is said to be the unofficial tallest man in Ghana. He is believed to be 8 feet tall. Awusi, as he is popularly called, aspires for greatness and international recognition with his gigantic stature. The 27-year-old says he started gaining abnormal height from the age of 10 and his parents had to consult an oracle for answers. In an interview, he said, his ultimate aim is to use his personality to attract international tourists to his hometown, adding that he is grateful for his height, which now puts food on his table. Competing with him is Charles Sogli, who is equally believed to be around 8 feet tall. Charles, who is 20 years old, now works as an apprentice in a welding shop after dropping out of school because he couldn't get his shoe size, among other challenges. Next is Brahim from Morocco. With a height of 8.7 feet or 2.46 meters, Brahim Takiola from the southern city of Guamim is the tallest person in Morocco. Born on the 26th of January 1982, Takiola holds the Guinness World Record for the largest feet and officially second tallest living person. He surpassed former record holder Sultan Hussein of Turkey as the Guinness World Record holder for world's largest feet on a living person. His left foot measures 38.1 cm and his right 37.5 cm. Next is Tabelo from South Africa. Tabelo Glenn is the tallest man in South Africa at 8.5 feet or 2.6 meters tall. Tabelo, who goes by the nickname Beans, is an undergraduate and a basketball player. He has a girlfriend who he is twice her height. They have tagged their love affair as Beans Love. They cause a stare wherever they go. Just for the records. As expected, there are other Africans who are equally very tall but are now dead. They include Monifura, who at 7.3 feet tall is said to still remain Algeria's tallest man. He died in January 2012. Next is Uganda's John Paul of Wono, who died in 2003 at the age of 43. He was 7.6 feet tall. Another one is Sudanese-born American basketball player and political activist Monute Bo, who was 7.7 .7 feet tall and was also said to be the tallest player in the history of the NBA, along with Romanian player Georgie Muresan.
His name means special blessing. His actual date of birth is not known, but he died on the 19th of June 2010. Next is Gabriel Mungene, who at 8.8 .8 feet tall was the tallest man in Mozambique. He was born in 1944 and died in January 1990 after a fall at his home, supposedly from the stairs. The Guinness Book of Records stated that he was the tallest living man in their 1988 edition. After his death, Suleiman Ali Nashnouj, another African, became the tallest living man. The Libyan basketball player and actor was born in 1943 and died in 1991. He was one of the tallest basketball players ever at 8.5 feet tall, but was put at around 7.10 when he played professional basketball. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe before leaving.